here. Everybody who's typing L, you gotta quit. That's the worst thing for your brain, I think, as a young man. And my, my audience is like 95% Gen Z, millennial men. You need to quit. You really need to stop now. And then you know what the follow-up question is? Who do you wanna quit? You just stop doing it. What do, you, what do you want me to tell you to do? Don't type in the website? Take it. Do you need me to explain to stop yanking your meat? Just stop doing it. That simple. Stop it. It's so bad for you. You're feeding your energy away to companies that want to take away all of your dopamine, all of your energy. Ugh, ugh, ugh. Weaker, weaker, weaker. Every bust. Stop it. Stop paying for OF girls. Stop looking at Instagram at all these thoughts. Just separate it. Focus on yourself. Protect your energy. Bob and weave all the distractions and watch what you're capable of. It worked for me. It worked for me. That's what I know. I'm not a self-help guru. I'm not a self-improvement pre- Bro, I'm just telling you it worked for me and I know that it's damaging for your brain. It's satisfying the simplest dopamine receptors in your mind. Just stop doing it. Stop. That simple. Stop. You want me to yell at you? Stop. Fuck is wrong with you? Stop doing that. Your life will be better. You know it's not making you happy. You know what most YouTubers will tell you? Like KSI, LSI, will say that I'm feeding my audience bullshit. He just so tweeted that at me, keep saying I'm gonna keep on telling my audience, audience bullshit while he has prawn stars in the side men Tinder video so they could all advertise their websites and their platform. They know their audience is a bunch of 12 year olds who are very likely to go pay for that and at the same time, call my course, the creativity kit, which is closed now, call it a scam. Knowing that they're just making their audience dumber, weaker, and more tired, draining their audience of their energy, and they still have the audacity, KSI has the audacity to say that I'm feeding my audience bullshit, while also saying, I'm just an entertainer. Not everything has to have a bigger message, mate. Okay, then don't say that I'm feeding bullshit if you're feeding nothing. I know that I said that I was just entertaining in the past. I had like one, 2,000 viewers in my life. Now this shit is 10X. I gotta have a message now. The Tate's got banned, Tristan Tate passed me the torch. I gotta keep the message alive. I cannot just be an entertainer. Someone needs a role model now. Someone out there, it could be important. Most of you don't, most of you just wanna laugh at these jokes. Bumbaka! Ha ha, funny. But there's a lot of people watching this who need to hear this. Stop watching Prawn now! Stop mindlessly scrolling on TikTok! It's making you fucking stupid! Make some money on this shit! Don't let all the OF girls take all your money! Get to it! Someone just heard that and their life should improve after hearing that. You can't just hear this and get a dopamine release from me saying that. You need to apply yourself and actually do it. There you go. There's the motivational bullshit ass speech for the day. Or you can listen to your favorite youtubers who are popping antidepressants man cancel that thank god tate's banned yeah amen praise god the tate was banned you can listen to other people praying on other people's downfall or listen to me i know i sound like an angry piece of shit but i have a positive message follow god make yourself better improve that's my message Laugh at everything have freedom of speech have open dialogue and real conversation don't be afraid of confrontation that's my message. And I know I'm just here like, some people are just gonna call me a goofy clown and stuff. Yeah, this shit is supposed to be funny too. But at least I have a message. I'm not just here, oh, I have nothing to say. I'm just KSI. Go beat your meats, lads. Fuck off. And don't follow me, I don't give a fuck. I'm not a clout demon. You know what he tweeted out? He's like, oh, thank God I've gotten, I haven't got enough time to talk to you. I'd be doing YouTube for way longer. All right, fine, I don't care. If you think you're too important to talk about this stuff, then keep on encouraging your 12-year-old audience to go spend their money on OnlyFans. That's what you want to do. Why, this motherfucker don't miss. No, he's fucking good. That motherfucker don't miss, man. He's good. In the heat of battle, he don't miss. No. In the heat of controversy, he don't miss.